Hi, I'm Paul Holt, CEO of Class on Demand. Class on Demand creates the best training in the world for digital content creators. The Class on Demand website is loaded with free high-res video tutorials on today's most popular software products. What you're about to see is a segment from a complete tutorial. When it's over, I'll tell you how to purchase the complete training at a discounted price. So enjoy today's free lesson, and I'll see you at the end. So let's go ahead and use this. We'll shorten this up just for time's sake here. And then what we're going to do is we're going to start the first half of our multi-pass edit. We're going to do a make movie. And what we're going to do first is we're going to export a file. Let's go call it create file. And what we'll do is we'll uh, put it in uh, your fast drive, your video drive. I'm going to put mine in project media here. And we're going to go first pass. Okay. Go first pass. And now what you'll see is it's actually compositing this as we speak. So it's all done. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and delete this. Let's click this. Now let's go back under edit. And you'll see if we go back now to our original content, which is Project Media, and you'll see that's where I put my first pass. Let's go up one level here. We'll pull first pass down here on the background layer. My chosen medium is... And you'll see that now we have one track that has both layers in it because what we did was we basically composited those together. Now the thing that's cool about this is we can go ahead and we can pull up Kirk's assets. Put those, This is once again his video reel. And let's go ahead and trim this in a spot that maybe we haven't seen yet. Let's just say we want a little bit more movement in here. Let's go like this and say, okay, I want that part of it. That kind of looks nice. Let's go ahead and split the clip. Remember, you can split it by using your razor blade or you can hit insert. I'm going to just click on the razor blade. And then what we'll do is we'll move that clip mm -hmm. over because I want a lot more movement. I don't want to stay on this one long clip on his, uh, his reel here. We want that to keep moving. So let's say we want to start with that one. Let's go ahead and trim that out. That kind of looks neat. We'll put that next. So we need to go in and shrink these two clips down now. And what we'll do is we'll go in to our plugins in our video toolbox. We'll use pan and zoom again. We'll bring this down. We'll bring this over. And you'll see now that we've got these great two clips. Motion art. We'll need to do that to the same one. Now a quick tip that I didn't do and I want to point out is if you add the pan and zoom before you split the clip you won't have to go in and add all the different uh, pan and zooms to the individual clips. If you look at the numerics here, you can actually clone those. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this one, which is the critical one, to make sure that this flower graphic down here is in exactly the same position of this original graphic up here. So it's a negative 5281. I'm going to do control C, which is copy. I'm going to select this clip here. I'm going to add a new effect. I'm going to go into pan and zoom. And remember, zoom was all the way down, so that was easy. But now what I'm going to do is I'm going to paste that number from the other clip in here. So Control v pastes the number in. Let's go ahead and tab to the next one. And now you'll see that that one moved over. It's in exactly the same position, so it'll be seamless when the two of them cut to one another. Let's go ahead and hit play. My chosen medium is... Motion art, which entitles uh, 2D and 3D animation. I've been using that through after. Good. Now, that this is a great example of multiple layer compositing using multiple passes. As you can see, you can do this as many times as you want to. If you wanted to have four picture in pictures, you would use this technique and just put them in the corners instead. Hello again. So if you thought this lesson was valuable, imagine what you could learn from the complete training product. So please visit our website at classondemand.com to order the training and to also view our entire product catalog. When you're checking out, enter the product code below for a 10% discount. It's that simple. So once again, on behalf of Class on Demand, I'm Paul Holtz. Thanks for watching.